Hello, my sexy little dollies. I am in Cyprus. Somebody pinch me, because I can't bloody believe it. I am staying in the sexiest villa. It is beau. It is absolutely stun. I just wasn't expecting it. And I'm here with my nieces, my sis, her boy. It's absolutely the vibe. I am loving life. Living my best life, loving it. Live, laugh, love, live, love, Cyprus. I heart Cyprus. I love it. Slay. There's the front door. You walk in, you see this. Lovely little, um, you walk straight into the living room. Also, look at those cats, little pussies. This is our gorgeous living room. It's bloody huge. I feel like I'm in a palace. When you come out of the living room, you've got a TV, you've got a bloody PlayStation down there. A PlayStation. What? Like what? Connected to the living room, you've got our kitchen, which is so nice. Like literally, oh my God. I have a thing about islands in a kitchen. Like, you know, like, in the middle of the kitchen, I love it. I just, in my future house, I will have an island, I'm telling you. I am manifesting it right here, right now. I want an island. Future husband, who's gonna build me a whole house. Listen up, okay, jokes, boss ass bitch. I'm gonna do it for myself. I'm gonna build my own house. This is my fridge, this. Oh. That was anticlimactic. Yesterday, it basically took a whole load of strength to open it, so I thought I'd like, do it again, but. It was really easy to open, so I made it awkward. Got a little dining area over here with like a little fruit bar and stuff. It's decorated so, so nicely, it's so cute. And you've literally got doors everywhere. Like you, you can get out of here. Like there's, you will not get trapped in this place. There's doors literally everywhere. And then if we go outside here, oh wow. Oh wow, look at that. She was made for this. She was literally made for this job. You've got all of our sunbeds and our beautiful, stunning, gorgeous pool. Look at her. She is a big old beauty. Got a little barbecue thing over there. This is what the outside looks like. It's literally amazing. And then you can walk up there or you can walk through here. I like to take the more scenic routes. We've, we go through an arch. I love it. The scenicness is just brilliant. Table and chairs. Got a bloody pool table. Couple people are gonna get fresh at that later and I'm not gonna name any names. Tilly. We have some resident cats. Hey. Hey girl. There's like three cats that come here every day. And they're kind of scary and I'm not a big fan of cats, but um, I can't really do much about yeah, it. If we go back inside, we've got a little toilet there. Then through here is my bedroom and it looks like I've got a bloody intruder again. It's a little bit of a mess right now because we're all in it and we've been getting ready. Got some fat wardrobe, so we've literally got so much space for everything. I've also got a cot because this is my pregnancy announcement. And then we've got a little ensuite. We've got my little bathroom in here. Lovely, um, lovely bra hanging up there. It's probably one of my favourite parts. The staircase. I love. I hate that. I hate that bit because you can fall down like two. Do you want to dance, baby? I like your outfit. You Nancy just baited you out. Do what do you have to say for yourself? I've got a big fat bruise in my bum. In here is Tilly's room. Absolutely stunned. It's pretty similar to mine, literally. Ensuite wardrobe. Yeah, but she's got a balcony and it is literally. She is such a dirty mess. What a dirty little pig. <laughs> do you want to go show them your room? Oh. Oh. That's a oh no. Oh no. Come in, come in. Wow, thank you so much. I don't know why I had these two. It's cause you're a baby. Oh, you're hiding all your mess real quick. Is that what you're doing? No. So this is Nancy's room. She's got all her clothes in there. She's got two beds because she's like super cool and bougie like that. Look at her giving it a clean up. I'm such a good influence. We should do this more often. Got another bathroom there. My sister's room's in there, but I can't go in it true because who knows what's going on in there. And I just love this. Look at this. B8 staircase. I literally got this yesterday from Zara. I'll give you a haul later because they're waiting for me as per usual because I'm late to everything. But this is from Zara. I've got a few other bits. But I've always wanted like a mini dress, you know, like a longer dress because I always wear short dresses because I'm so small. Mini dresses, they just don't really suit me. Oh, I got this one and I actually quite like it. You don't have to mm. tell me something. Cheers. Oh, <laughs> Cheers. Lily, stop, man. Cheers. You're well annoyed. You're well funny. I love you. Actually. Yeah, you like these ones? Mum! Oh, Mummy! Wow, Hold it! You really I feel like my sister's so lucky to have a sister like me that pulls off absolutely yeah. everything. No, I don't know. It's weird. <laughs> Sorry. Hello, everybody. Fun fact about Lily, she hates physical touch unless it's from a man. And get my room though? Yeah. 
Should have seen your slinky face. Oh, Lily! <laughs> no, please! Oh, cool, you call that no sticks up, bit. <laughs> look at that big beak, you look like a little parrot. Get your feet off me! <laughs> we're in Paphos in Cyprus, and the first thing we got here, we were at McDonald's. Straight up, at the airport, got the car, went to McDonald's. I got six chicken eggs and chips if you wanted to know. Yesterday, we went to a shopping centre. Skills on the hey? Watch this. Oh, wait. So, first things first in this green dress. It's a mini dress. See? Two bags. I'm not even lying. I actually I did buy stuff. And I never have successful shopping trips. So, I'm really happy. These are two separate pieces. I did not buy them to be an outfit. However, I think separately they could be cute. They have potential. Now, these vests, I did not expect it to fit this well. Like it actually fits and also it's long and I wear a lot of low rise stuff but I feel like I just wear a lot of crop stuff because I'm I'm joking. Oh I need to stop making that joke because I don't think anyone finds it funny. Tilly has every single colour of the Zara vest. She repurchases them more than she has repurchased anything before. When I saw it I just I didn't think it'd be tight fitting and I thought it'd like be really a rubbish fit. I think I think my video is getting robbed. And also, a lot of people have been wearing the backwards, so like this bit's at the front, and I think that's really cute. And I think I'm actually gonna have to purchase some of these myself. I'm not gonna lie. This is a Zara score. Yes, it has shorts beneath. I think scores were a great invention because I can wear a really, really short skirt, but it's not actually a skirt. So you can't see anything. Okay, so pretty much ignore everything about this. However, this is from Strength Ferris. I've literally seen it everywhere. I mean, I want to be like everyone else. Uh, I don't want to be me. I want to be you, probably. I wouldn't wear it with me gym jam shorts or a Zara vest, would I? That would be a bit silly. Tomorrow, we're going on a boat or something, which I, I can't wait to do that. But. I'm gonna look extremely ugly because basically Tilly's gonna got like eyelash extensions and she looks hot. She looks hot without them. She's a hottie. She's a beautiful young lady and she's blossoming into a beautiful woman. However, I look like a naked mole right next to her because, like, when I have no makeup on, because I have no like I have eyelashes but they're bl I'm blonde, you know. So we brought like eyelash things and I'm gonna go and persuade her right now to put them on me and if she doesn't I'm gonna punch her. I'm gonna put it on me. I think you woke the whole of the island up. <sighs> Why did you scream like that? You scared me. Because earlier I thought I was getting rolled. <laughs> Why did you scream like that, you stupid woman? <laughs> Why have you faced me six times as well? You do realise we're on an island, I can't get any signal. Yeah, but I, I miss you though. You're all the way upstairs. Hi guys. That's my friend. Um, can you do my eyelashes for me? Right now? Yeah, because we're going on the boat. I'm going to be really ugly. Oh, God. <laughs> Look at me. No, oh I'm my God, I'm so pale. Clean. No, you're not clean. <laughs> Can't do it. Wait. Yeah, no, you still got mascara all over your eyelashes. Can't do Get it. Get off me. You're not nice. You're rude. That's what I was trying to think of. Did he stop blocking my hair? Yeah, we had to get, um, we had to find the hose for the pool because Lily drained the pool with her nose. <laughs> she got in, she got in, she done a bomb and it all went up her nose because it's so big. It's like the opening of a funnel and it all sucked up so you had to hose the pool down in it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah Look at how you're sat right now, seriously. Imagine I've got so much control right now because I've got the tweezers in my hand and I'm going to pluck your eye out of your socket if you don't stop. What a twat. What an actual twat. This is why... 
I don't get left alone in the kitchen, ever. It's been lovely cut up by my apprentice, Tilly. And then what we're going to do is we're going to take our knife, stuff it into that Nutella, and absolutely oh, yeah. lather that on like you've never had it before. Well, if you've never had it before, you'd be quite staring. Tilly, shut up. Actually, you? Tilly, shut up. Tilly, shut up. I'm absolutely ravishing, Marie. Ravishing or ravenous? Because I'm not. Yeah. yeah. It's all like self before you're hungry. I don't know how to use words. Well done for making fun of me. Thanks. A lot. What we one? Absolute masterpiece of a creation. It looks like a Krabby Patty. When I used to eat mini channels, I used to like stack three and I eat it like and pretend it was a burger. Fun fact, actually, really, really sad fact. I can't really swim. I can paddle. I can doggy paddle. I can't. I, like, I can swim, but I can't swim. I mean, like, I'm not a strong swimmer. Like, I know the basics. I was trying to teach Nancy, so she probably won't learn much from me. But I'm trying, trying my best. Um, but right now, I really want to learn how to dive. I really want to be able to dive. Like, I really want to learn how to dive because, like, how fit? I want to like be serious sometimes. I want to be taken seriously. And I feel like if I know how to dive, then I'll be taken seriously. You want to know something that's really bugging me? Every single drink I have here tastes like water. Everything. Like, fair enough, these ones are like low sugar. The ones that we have here, because everyone here drinks low sugar apart from me. Because I like the full sugar. Like, because cause what's the point in having a fizzy, sugary drink when it's not actually that fizzy and fit? It's not very sugary, is it? No, it's this not. This is an outfit I've got on, which is really cute. It's from PLT. However, I've kind of messed up a little bit because look at this big, like, bulky white bra I've got on. It just doesn't look great. I feel like it's just like too solid, you know? Does that make sense? Sorry for grabbing my boobs in front of you. That's probably really uncomfortable, but oh well. We've all got them. We've, got, we've all got nips and, and all that jazz. restaurant and do you know what I thought I'd give a quick review so the coke 10 out of 10 it was a great coke best kind of coke I've had since I got here and do you know what maybe I spoke too soon but maybe I was meant to say what I said to put it out into the universe because now the universe has like listened to me and what I've been missing out on and they've just made me really really happy so I think you should always speak your mind and be yourself because everybody else is taken Oh, that's so rude. <laughs> got a big sexy Olivia. Why is that first 
Because I love you. You've got your own town. If you just keep going, you won't think about it. I can't drink. Seriously. <laughs> yeah. I've actually just rolled my phone. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, I see the flashlight again. So we keep going. No, I'm really scared. There's people. No, I'm really you know scared. Don't leave. Maybe they need help. <laughs> I'm really scared to leave. Just keep going. Yeah, so we keep going. So we keep going. We walk. We're going to Rasayella Villa. So I'll beat them up. It's all right. I'm Just strong, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah I'll find one no, it's here. I swear, that flashlight's moving closer and closer. Move. Three sexy blondes. Wow. Three sexy blondes. <laughs> what? Just getting a random fella's car? Yeah, I don't mind. Listen, guys, it is the last day for me, for us, to fully sit outside and try and get a tan, you know, like. Get our can on, sit out there, oil ourselves up, and just lay in the sun. We need to do it now because we don't have much time, okay? I don't usually do too well in the sun, but today I'm in business, and I swear to God, I am gonna. I'm gonna be tanned. Because if I'm not tanned, then I'm gonna sue. And then that's not good because nobody wants me to sue. I don't know who I'm gonna sue, but I'm gonna sue someone. I am ready to rumble. That is well off. <laughs> can you see the literal drops? Of sweat all over me. I'm dripping, like I'm literally dripping in sweat, like actual sweat. The holiday is coming to an end, isn't it? Yeah. It's our last night in Cyprus, and we're gonna dull this one up a little bit, aren't we? Yeah. We're gonna get all dulled up, go out on the tan. Can you see my bag? What bag? My sequin bag. No. Ooh. I need some eyeliner. Eyeliner, eyeliner. Can I see? Can I have some eyeliner? Ooh, pretty. Oh, oh God, you want to go all out, didn't you, girl? Wow. So beautiful. Show everyone. Oh, she's so pretty. There was a beautiful sunset out here just a couple of minutes ago that I wanted to show you, but looks like I'm a bit too late. So you can have this instead. I mean, you can still kind of see it. It was so pretty. We are all dressed and ready to go to the last meal of the holiday, which is actually really, really sad. I feel like I need to permanently be on holiday because I'm just... I feel like I thrive anywhere but London, but home. So I feel like maybe I need to move. Maybe I need to do something like that. But do you know what I really want to do? I really want to go in-trailing. Like the couple holidays I've been on this year have just made me want to like travel and stuff. Like Paris, oh my God, that was amazing. This has been amazing. I just want to go in-trailing. I feel like that'd be such a cool experience, but I need someone to go with. So comment down below and I'll send you the details and we'll go together, all of us. Nobody knows. Oh my god. Sing it. Nobody knows. <laughs> no. Nobody knows. <laughs> get out there. I can't get out. <laughs> ow. 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 Let's see. Let's Oh, <laughs> 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 <